guys welcome to my channel my name is alicia if this is your first time here so for today's video i decided to do a review on the new maybelline urban maybelline urban cover foundation and supposedly this foundation expert it's like um foundation was especially formulated to shield the skin from harmful environment aggressors let's say you live in a city like mine new york city we have a lot of pollution um you know and it's just a dirty city to be honest new york city is dirty like for real um so the great part is that it has spf so you don't have to wear spf under um unless you want to wear like super 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 spf but yeah um it has it's enriched with antioxidants to protect to protect against pollution it leaves a natural looking finish but protects your skin all day and like i said it comes in 16 shades um and yeah let's see how this foundation works ladies this doesn't even look like a drugstore foundation like it's my all-time favorite drugstore foundation and what i love about the packaging is that it's not glass it comes in like this tube kind of um bottle and it also has a tip applicator um which is great let's say you're traveling i think this foundation is really good for traveling days because it does has spf and you can also wear like your beach days or if you're out and about whatever the case is you'll be protected you don't need to worry about sunscreen and that's what i really love about it i really love the packaging like i'm obsessed with it because it's so like you can put it anywhere you can fit it into you know so let's get right into this. For today's primer, I am going to be using the YSL Instant Pore Refining. Well, yeah, Instant Pore Refining Primer, and this is what it looks like. So we're gonna go ahead and just apply that to all the areas. This primer smells so good. Like, it doesn't have like a perfume scent, but it smells so good, guys. It smells like, I feel like I've had like a perfume. It doesn't smell like perfume, perfume, but I feel like I have had like something that smells similar to it. It just smells like, you know what? It smells like spa, like a spa. Like, oh, I'm obsessed. Okay, so now like the face is all perk and prime. Just make sure we lock that in. Okay. So now we're gonna go on to the foundation. I'm gonna be using the shade 330, which is toffee. And we're just gonna go ahead and distribute it on the face. I'm gonna drip down. This foundation is full coverage, so it'll let's see how it'll act out. I didn't want to color correct or anything like that because I really want to see how would it play out. Of what it looks like when you blend it out with a brush. And then we're gonna go over and we're just gonna blend it out with a with a sponge. So this color is a little bit darker than me, but I don't mind because I do have a tan. It does have a scent to it, more like a sunscreen kind of scent to it. Yeah, it smells like sunscreen. But like instantly guys, it gives you like this nice glow, full coverage, like no complaints over here. Instantly gives you that good, good coverage. Um, and it just, you know, a little goes a long way. I did use a, uh, more than I was supposed to, but a little goes a long way with this foundation. Um, it sets really nicely. Like, I like how this looks. Wow. I feel like drugstore foundations are doing good thing. So this is what it looks like so far with just a brush. Now we're gonna go on and I'm gonna use a fresh um, clean beauty blender and we're gonna go over the foundation to make sure that we don't have no streaks Wow 
and I believe this foundation retails for about let me just check just to confirm this foundation um, is $12.99 God, look at this. So clean, such an airy. It doesn't feel heavy. I truly feel truly protected from the um, foundation. Like it feels like it's just locking in my skin together. Um, I really like it. I really do, guys. So now I'm gonna go ahead and put on my concealer. Let's see how it looks like with the concealer on top. Some foundations do not, um, you know, like act good when you put something on top of it and stuff like that. So it blended out really good with my concealer. I'm using the Fenty concealer and it looks really good. Um, Honestly, guys, this foundation is beautiful. This is perfect. I believe this foundation is more perfect for an everyday lifestyle because you have SPF 50. This foundation, I mean, SPF 50 is not only for the summertime, guys. SPF 50, you do have to wear when it's raining and when it's cold. You do want to protect your skin. I feel like this foundation, it's also a good foundation, let's say if you're traveling. Like, um, I just really like it. Like I said, it's really good foundation, it's a good investment. It's only $12.99. It's not a BB cream or a CC cream, so it'll give you more coverage than a BB cream and a CC cream. It still has antioxidants on the foundation, so it'll help your skin eventually you know get you a greater um, complexion and stuff like that so I really like this now I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna finish my whole face and I'll be back guys. alright guys so I went ahead and did my whole face of makeup and look at this foundation it does have like a little glow to it it's not matte finish but guys I am totally impressed by how this foundation looks like look <laughs> What? What? ¿Qué tú me estás diciendo a mí? 12 pesos. Yo lo compro. 12.99, sis. This is all it costs. 12.99. Wow, guys. This is a seal. So I didn't do nothing too crazy. All I did was set the concealer down with some Laura Mercier powder. Went ahead with my full routine of my basic everyday makeup kind of thing. Um, and I'm gonna go actually run some errands. I'll be back and I'll show you guys how this foundation wears out through the, throughout the day. So let's just take a closer little look at how it looks. How it looks on here, here, here. So we're gonna go run some errands and I'll be back in like a few hours and let's see how it looks. Bye guys. So this is a check-in. It's been approximately five hours since I filmed this video. It's already nighttime, and so far it like creased a little bit on my mouth area. Sorry, like my lipstick and all that came off. But like, it's looking good. Like, look okay. at it's oiling up a little bit over here. Like it's like not separating I want to say separating but like yeah it's not separating it's like a little fine line but you can barely see it unless like somebody's like all up in your face but yeah I really love how this foundation works guys like look at it it's so nice you have a, like a dewy kind of like you know like I think you guys should buy it.